this is what it looks like when I air dry my hair overnight. I think I'm gonna try a new fun hairstyle today. And also, I don't feel like straightening this entire mess of a lion's mane. So I think what I'm gonna do, and I've done this um, hairstyle before, um, I wanna do like two little braids, like right here, and then it comes down. We're gonna try that. It's been a while since I last did that. Also, my coffee was from this morning. Originally hot, now iced because hot coffee time is over. I'm gonna first brush so I can part my hair straight down the middle. I'm just using like a random spoolie brush. Okay. It's always the back that I have the problem with parting. Okay. I'm gonna take the top layer of my hair, like just a tiny little piece like this, and what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start braiding, and I guess what I'm gonna do is like a French braid. So I'm just gonna cross over and add hair on onto each strand. I really don't know how to do hair tutorials, so don't come at me for my tutorial, but I'm just basically doing a little French braid. So it's starting right here and it's gonna go, I don't know how to show you, it's gonna go all the way back here and then I'm gonna do a strand down. Does that make sense? I don't know. And then once I get to like the back of my head, that's when I start just braiding my hair down. I think we're getting towards the end here. I just like to braid all the way down to where I can't braid the strands anymore. I'm gonna take an elastic and just tie it off and that's what it looks like. I'm gonna show you more on the other side of what I'm doing. So again, taking a top section of my hair up in the front, split it off into three sections and then start the braid and then add hair into the braid. And I'm just taking like super small strands of hair because I don't want this to be a super thick braid. And then just do a normal braid all the way down. I really don't like to get fancy with braids because I don't really know how to do a French braid that well. It looks super, super cute. Typically when I do this hairstyle, I actually braid my hair the night before so it looks more crimped, but this is more of like a natural hair and my hair doesn't look too crazy and then i'm gonna go in with this new wave spray i just got this is from ava nyc it's the lazy jane salt free wave spray they actually gifted this to me and i thought i would try it because you know i have wavy hair and i want to accentuate the waves and not make it like so frizzy it has no sulfates parabens it's vegan cruelty free recyclable like scrunch it. it smells really good I don't want to like spray this oh my gosh I'm getting it on my mirror and on my phone so proceed to that with caution I'm just gonna like scrunch this up this would be like perfect to do on like a summer day when you're like done from the pool and you like want to just accentuate the waves that you got when you get out of the pool I don't know how much of this like put in use me by shaking well and spraying throughout damp or dry hair give me a few scrunches and wait for beach waves to appear no vacation day is necessary well it's definitely doing its job so this is what it looks like it's definitely defining the waves a little bit more as I scrunch through it. Thank you so much for sending me this Eva NYC, but I'm gonna go ahead and clean up my phone, my desk, and my mirror because I literally got the spray everywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this up and then I'm gonna get dressed and get some content done and I'll be right back with you guys after all that. So I finished getting ready a long time ago. I have like a little white top on. Um, I did get dressed. I went on a walk with my dad and then I had lunch. Now I'm done with all of that and I've been doing a lot of content creating for a brand. 
So I just need to do like a quick tidy up, get everything together, and then move on with my day. I feel like this day has gone by so quick, so we might have to continue this vlog into tomorrow possibly. But I still have a lot that I need to do and I'm just gonna take you guys along. So first I'm gonna do a quick tidy up. It is currently the next day. I think the last time I filmed was in this exact spot, but I have my cleaning shirt on, which you know what that means. It's time to scrub the bathrooms. I'm gonna go ahead and knock out cleaning the bathroom so I can go ahead and get ready and shoot some content today. I am planning on going out to a coffee shop. I have to get a clip for a reel I'm filming and then I wanna go and take like car pics or something for Instagram. So I'll take you guys on the behind the scenes of that. We have yet another productive day. I don't know how much I really vlogged yesterday, but that was another productive day. So we're just carrying it on today. so sweaty <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for the day and then next up I'm gonna go ahead and get some content done go out it's a little rainy out so I don't know how good content is gonna be with lighting and everything so I'm gonna go ahead and get ready and I'll go back to you guys once I look more presentable <laughs> Okay, I'm all dressed up and ready. I just had lunch. I'm literally about to go right now. I think I'm running a little bit behind schedule. So I'm gonna go ahead and get in the car. I'm gonna get some coffee, do a little bit of content shooting in the car, pick up my sister, and then do the rest of the content and the editing that I need to get done at home. Okay, you guys, I just pulled up to the waterfront. I got my coffee. I got a vanilla oat milk latte. I'm gonna go ahead and take some photos. There's literally two men in their cars right next to me on both sides. So I don't know how I'm gonna do this very nonchalantly, but they're on their phones and like napping. So I think it will be okay. I think I got the shot, y'all. I think I got the shot. The lighting is so good. I was honestly so worried about that because it is a super overcast day. Now I'm at the pickup line to pick up my sister from school. I got her a little coffee as well, the same thing I got. That shoot was very successful. I don't remember what I vlogged because it was more focused on getting the content. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna go through the photos, edit them, and I think that's all the content I need to get today. I got a lot of good content, so I'm very happy about that. Have my lo-fi music playing but i am about to sell some clothes on depop i have a few clothes that don't fit me anymore typically if i want to get rid of clothes i just pass them on to my sister but she's not interested in any of them so i'm gonna go ahead and sell them on depop um i'm gonna go ahead and start taking the photos for those and then post them and then just wait and see if i have any orders i had one depop order so far and it went pretty smoothly, so I'm just gonna keep using the app. Super chill night. I'm going to take the rest of the night to edit this video so it goes up on Friday, but I'm gonna go ahead and get started by taking the photos of the clothes. Okay, so I have all the clothes laid out here. I have joggers from Victoria's Secret Pink, a couple Hollister jeans. I feel like these are gonna go faster than the rest of the items, and then I have this little t-shirt dress. It's honestly a little too small on me, so so that's the only reason why I'm getting rid of it. But I got this from Old Navy. I think I'm going to take some shots, like some flat lays on my bed. And then take a photo like right here on a hanger, probably with 
the t-shirt dress, but I'm just gonna go ahead, snap some photos and upload these to Depop. And everything is live. Does not look the best. My Instagram feed looks a lot better than this, but my at is at Faith Elizabeth R underscore. If you wanna follow me on Depop, I'm not on here often, only when I'm doing little listings like this, which this is actually my second time selling on Depop. And I already have six followers, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for bed and end off this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, follow me on my socials. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in my next video really soon.